What do you think? What do you think about what just happened? Cool because my mum always has really bad problems with her hip yeah. and now she just helps her and it's really nice. Yeah, and why did we stop you? How did we stop you? Because you said um, because something. I said that my mum's hips are being naughty. And I heard the word naughty, right? Yeah, and, and I she turned around and said she's being naughty. What do you think? It's crazy. I can't believe it. Had you ever seen anything like that? No. Never. Wow. It's so, so crazy. Has this made you change what you think about Jesus and God? Yeah. Do you think he's real? Yeah. 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 It's amazing, right? He is real. He's here right now. Yeah. yeah. Thank you so much. Wow. You just blow my mind. Thank you so much. I wear my a bit crazy. Um, I was on the escalator with my daughter and my daughter was saying naughty. I was asked what was naughty. I said my hip because I suffer with a bad hip. And then I was asked would I like my pain to go away and I met the lovely Jessica who literally on the escalators touched my hip and my pain went straight away. And then when I was walking I was still clicking and then she held my hip for longer and then my clicking stopped. And obviously it's made me emotional and I start to cry because it's amazing. Wow. And how's and that? And we're still in Marks and Spencer's and that was five minutes. Yeah, and we're not even in a church, right? <laughs> no, we're not in a church <laughs> building. So does church. Jesus... We're shopping. <laughs> right, we're shopping, right? So can Jesus meet people in the shops? Yes. Yeah. He can and, uh, anywhere, and you know you felt you felt like crying. What how how does that make you feel different about Jesus right now? I believe in the power of God. Yeah. Obviously. Cool. I feel all emotional. I feel really that like, inside me. And do you know why you feel emotional? It's because he meets you he he loves you as well. It's not just about a trick, right? He loves you to the core of who you are. He wants the best we for need who you to go are. Go back to church, that's how it's made me feel. Yeah. Because I used to go to church every Sunday, didn't we? And I haven't been for a while and it has played on my mind and it's made me feel like, yeah, I met you guys today for a reason. Mm -hmm. Definitely. Yeah. yeah. He's Just, calling you, right? No yeah. one comes to, to the Father unless he's being drawn. I need to, uh, feel that I need to go back to church. That's amazing. Well, remember, remember. Amazing, guys. Yeah. Remember and I've had a really witness. stressful morning. Have yeah. you? Haven't I? Yeah. So you guys have just made me chill out. We're going to have a great day now, aren't we? Yeah. 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 <laughs> so thank you for helping my mum because she always has really bad shit. Oh. Yeah. Well, yeah. can you can you say thank you, Jesus, as well? Thank you, Jesus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank you. Okay, thank you're you awesome. Thank you. Well, that was an Hey everyone, um, so we came out today with Rory and Anna and I came here with my husband Osan and we just really wanted to see um, the kingdom come into people's lives and um, I find it hard to approach people and start conversation. I know I do trust that the spirit will move but um, I also have a bit of um, fear in me that people are going to reject. Um, reject my offer of trying to pray for them or to try and heal them so um, we're here in M&S home at the moment and um, Rory took the initiative and asked the lady who was um, on the escalator in front of us if uh, he, she heard the kids say the word naughty and so he turned around and said oh, what's naughty and she said it was her hip and it just seemed like this lady was placed on that escalator behind us for the reason of God wanting to encounter her that day. And um, anyway, God showed up, it was incredible. Um, Rory asked me to point at her where the pain was in her hip. And initially, at the beginning, there was the, the carnal mind saying, but what if nothing happens? Um, but I just decided to go along with it and not to think too much, not to think anything. And the amazing thing is that her 
pain went away, it left her. But not only that, I mean, the Holy Spirit just really touched her and she um, got emotional and started crying. Um, so I just, it was just incredible because I was really encouraged and I just saw how much it is really God's, the power of God and um, we're just being uh, like an instrument and loving people. Just